हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू द मैप ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व दिस नाइस मैथ ओलंपियड अलजबरा प्रॉब्लम एंड हियर वी हैव x 6 टू द पावर 4 प्लस x 8 टू द पावर 4 इक्वल्स टू 16 एंड वी सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम फॉर द वैल्यूज ऑफ x सो द वेरी फर्स्ट थिंग वी आर गोइंग टू डू इज हियर फर्स्ट वी रीराइट दिस इक्वेशन एज x 6 एंड इट्स होल पावर 4 Plus, we write this equation as x minus six minus two because here we have minus eight. We break this minus eight as minus six minus two, and its whole power four equals to sixteen. And now in the next step, uh, you see here we have x minus six be the common expression, so that we take it common or we take x minus six equals to y, and we obtain. Over above quadratic equation in this form, y equals to x minus six, so that the above equation implies that y to the power of four plus y minus two to the power of four equals to sixteen. And now first here uh, we focus on this expression. Now we first simplify uh, this expression and we write it as y to the power of four. Plus y minus two and its whole square and its whole square. We break its exponent four and we write it as two to the exponent of two because when we multiply these two exponents, then you get four and it is equals to sixteen. So that uh, in the next step we open the one square of this here and you get y to the power of four plus Now we use the square identity, and you get y square plus four minus two times of two is minus four y, and its whole square equals to sixteen. And now here we use uh, the square identity under the three variables or three digits. You know that the formula of a plus b plus c and its whole square equals to A square plus B square plus C square plus two times of AB plus two times of BC plus two times of CA. So we use this nice formula on uh, this expression, uh, and we get the output of this expression in this form. So we have y to the power of four plus we uh, open the square of this term, and you get. y to the power of 4 plus 16 and we have the square of minus 4y will be equals to plus 16y square and after that we have two times of ab so you get two times of a is uh, so here we write two times of y square into 4 and plus two times of bc so two times of b is 4 and c is Minus four y and plus two times of c a, so our c is minus four y and a is y square and this whole equals to sixteen. And now we uh, add or subtract the like terms here and we get its output in this form. So first you add y to the power four plus y to the power four, it is equals to two times of y to the power of four. And after that, uh, we have six. This sixteen. So here you have this plus sixteen, and in the right hand side we have sixteen. So this sixteen is cancelled out by this sixteen, and we obtain here plus sixteen y square, and you have four times of two is eight times of y square, and here we have minus four times of four is sixteen. Sixteen times of two is thirty two. Minus two times of thirty-two y, and here you have minus eight times of y cubed equals to zero. And now we uh, simplify uh, this equation, and uh, we again add or subtract the like terms, and you get two to the power of two times y to the power of four plus sixteen plus eight will becomes twenty-four times of y square. And we have minus thirty-two times of y minus eight times of y cubed equals to zero. And now here you see that we have 
टू वाई बी द कॉमन एक्सप्रेशन सो दैट वी टेक कॉमन टू वाई हेयर एंड यू गेट वाई क्यूब प्लस हेयर यू हैव ट्वेल्व टाइम्स ऑफ वाई एंड हेयर यू गेट सिक्सटीन बिकॉज वी टेक इट कॉमन वाई एंड हेयर यू अपटेन माइनस फोर टाइम्स ऑफ वाई स्क्र एंड दिस होल इक्वल टू जीरो सो दैट हेयर वी हैव टू केसेज सो आवर फर्स्ट केस इज वी राइट इट एज टू टाइम्स ऑफ वाई इक्वल्स टू जीरो एंड द सेकेंड केस इज वी री रेंज फर्स्ट दिस इक्वेजन एंड वी राइट वाई क्यूब माइनस फोर टाइम्स ऑफ वाई स्क्र प्लस ट्वेल्व टाइम्स ऑफ वाई माइनस सिक्सटीन इक्वल्स टू जीरो सो वी हैव दीज टू केसेज सो वी फर्स्ट फोकस ऑन द केस वन एंड इन दिस केस यू गेट द वैल्यू ऑफ वाई इक्वल्स टू जीरो एंड नाउ वी पुट back substitute the value of y so that and in the start of the question we take uh, y equals to x minus 6 so we back substitute the value of y and you get x minus 6 equals to 0 so the first root of this question will be x equals to 6 so this is the our first real root of this uh, given question and now we move or focus on the second case and in the second case first we write it here y cubed minus 4 times of y square plus 12y minus 16 equals to 0 so now we solve this cubic equation and here uh, we need to solve this cubic equation by using the synthetic division so that we use here synthetic division so uh, in order to use the synthetic division first we need the a uh, factor of this equation so that by inspection uh, you easily find the factor of this equation and we have the factor of this equation is y equals to 2 so when we substitute y equals to 2 here then you easily check that 8 minus 16 plus 24 minus 16 equals to 0 so this will be comes here uh 32 because minus 16 minus 16 is 32 and this is 32 minus 32 equals to 0 and 0 equals to 0 so this shows that y equals to 2 be the root of this equation okay so it is the root or solution of this given equation and now we use synthetic division so in order to use the synthetic division first we write the coefficients of this equation so we have the coefficients of this equation are so first we write here the coefficient of y cube it is 1 the coefficient of y square minus 4 the coefficient of y is 12 and other is 16 and we have the root of given equation is 2 so that first here we first write this term as it is and it is 1 so we write it as 1 and now we multiply this 1 by 2 and you get 2 minus 4 plus 2 is minus 2 and minus 2 times of 2 is minus 4 and 12 minus 4 is 8 and 8 times of 2 becomes 16 so this will become 0 so 0 be the over remainder and now we have the depressed equation uh, is written as y square minus 2y Plus eight equals to zero. So this is the our depressed equation. And now uh, we check that is this quadratic equation has real root or not? Because in this question we need only the real solutions. So that we use the discriminant formula. In order to use the discriminant formula, first we write the coefficients of this equation, and we have a equals to one, b equals to minus two, and c equals to eight. So that the discriminant formula will be Uh, uh, looks like in this form delta equals to b square minus 4 times of ac and now we check the values of abc and we uh, check the behavior of this equation so we have minus 2 square minus 4 times of a is 1 and c is 8 and you obtain 4 times of 4 minus 32 and you get minus 28 and you see that our delta will becomes lesser than 0 and if our delta is less than 0 so it means that this quadratic equation has complex roots so it gives the no real 
root but in this question we need to find only real roots so that we will reject this case because we need only real roots so in this question uh, we have only one real root which is x equals to 6 so that x equals to 6 be the only solution of this question and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos